Sorry, Joseph. Doug, on your right, sophomore board, Tayshawn Thomas, for the questions for the student council. What was the reason for the, if you all thought it was a slow start in the first half of the game, what caused that? A slow start? Uh, I think the slow start was kind of going to where we haven't played in the week. And we just had, a lot of us had to just get back in the groove of playing again. So I think that's why we started off with the slow. Uh, the same thing Tay was saying, you know, sitting out a week and just anxious to play. I mean, we just, we was ready to play, but we just came out slow, but we picked it up as the game was going. Did y'all make a point to get it to you down low, Tay? Yeah, coaches always say uh, we need to, our off, the, the primary goal of the offense is inside out, play inside first and the outside shots open. So we tried to establish something, some uh, scoring inside so they can sink in and kick it out to Joe and the other guards to knock down. So the so second half, you seem to come out and just kill the shots. It was, what was the reason? You just find it open and just feed to you? Well, you know, it, just, it was open shots, you know. Just the, the shots I, I practicing, you know, I got one for Tayshawn. Just, just sitting, sitting my feet and just be ready for the shot. But, you know, as a team, we, we played good as a team. Um, on the defensive end, everybody was hustling, winning the 50-50 plays. Pretty much what I like, but Chris was great. Tayshawn, I noticed that, the, what, the dunk you missed before he yeah. yeah, I see you smiling about that. <laughs> what happened? Because uh, I looked over Coach Dickey and he was kind of... He was telling me I, uh, I tried to dump it to him. Uh, I, I think it just slipped out at the last moment and hit the back of him and came yeah. out. So. At least I didn't get hung like earlier. <laughs> like, did you see his look on I me? Mean, did you notice that? He was, yeah, he okay. already, when I came out, he told me, I, he was like, you tried to dump it to him. I said, calm down. Mm -hmm. Got a little too excited when I seen the room and nobody in there. Either one of y'all, talk about uh, Valentine and what he brings, it could bring as he goes on to the team? Well, you know, he's a young man, 17. If you just keep working and then just go harder and practice and then just carry it over to the game, he'd be a great paid player. Just I'm talking about like Hakeem Olajuwon. Yeah, he reminds him, because the young coach that he reminds him a lot of Hakeem because he came in, Hakeem's kind of the same way. And uh, I think God can bring a lot of rebounds, block shots. You can help on the defensive end a lot. And his offensive game is getting better every day, so I think that can, I mean, as he gets better and better, he'll be a great player. You guys get, you know, excited on the bench when uh, he scores <laughs> and you guys something excited you do. Y'all talk about how y'all enjoy watching him score. To me, watching Valentine's like my little brother playing. You know, he gets on he gets on my nerves all the time, but gotta 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 hang out with his teammates. We feel like family here, so he's like a little brother. So watching him play and do well every day in the game when he gets in, it's just exciting for me. Uh, y'all held them to 34% shooting for the game. And I know y'all been practicing on talking to each other, communicating on defense. Is that what helped y'all to hold them to 34%? Yeah, you know, defense, you can't play defense without talking. You got to help your, your teammate. Like, say, for the back screen, though, we have to help tell you. It's just it's communication. You have communication on defense, and you play good on defense. And I think before the week, before this whole week of practice, and a couple of weeks before that, we just been talking about talking on defense to try to play better in defense. It's been helping us that when you talk, you can help somebody where they don't know where something's at. So talking has helped out a lot. Anything that y'all would like to improve upon going forward? Mm, I kind of feel like we could uh, be more consistent on turnovers. I feel like, I don't know if we turn the ball over a lot, but I feel like we, we have 14 to 14, 14 to 14 assists ratio. But uh, I feel like we could have cut back some of those turnovers, just slowing down on the press break and everything else. So take care of the ball. What do you think you need to work on? Is there anything personal you need to work on? You'd like uh, to see a little better the rest of the season with both of y'all? I think I need to go to Glass more, and I think I need to work on defense on the perimeter. I mean, I feel like I'm kind of decent at guarding in the paint. And when I have to step out to guard somebody faster, I need to be able to move my feet. Uh, you know, me just got to just get into the basket, to the free throw line, because I know I'm a good free throw shooter. So I just keep going to the basket, uh, more free throws as the season goes on. And uh, playing defense, better defense, off ball screens. Anything else? All right. Thank you very much. Thanks, guys. Merry Christmas. Have a Merry Christmas. How many days are you off now?